Hello everyone, welcome to the channel and today I will show you how to create a feature class in ArcGIS Pro. So let's get started. So now let us take a data set that is already available here. So here, so here we have a map of Africa. So here the map is visualized using a different colors and shape. So here we can able to visualize three different types of information. So that is we can visualize a point data. So here a location is represented as a point and similarly we have a second type of data that is polygon. So here the entire Sudan is, is shown in a polygon and similarly we have third type of data that is line. So line here is represented as a line that is Nile River in Sudan. So the three different types of uh, so here we have three different types of information a point information a line information and uh, a polygon so oh, that is a polygon information so the point is represented as a location and a line is represented as, represented as a river as a feature and the entire country the sudan is represented as a polygon so here we have three different types of uh, features so we have our point feature that is represented as a location and we have our line feature that is represented as a river and third is our polygon that is represented as a boundary of this country that is Sudan. So here the line feature is represented as a river, the river is represented as a line and similarly the point can be represented as a well location represented as a points. And similarly the third data that is polygon, the polygon can be represented as a lake so now let me get back to ArcGIS Pro and these are called the different types of feature class and it is a very important distinction to make so as soon as we create a data set we have to make sure that the particular feature is a point a line or a polygon feature so here we have shown you that here the river Nile is represented as a line there is a line feature and the entire country the Sudan is represented should be represented as a polygon and similarly a location of the specific uh, region can be represented as a point data so now let me show you an an another example so now uh, you can able to visualize the country called Australia so here we can uh, visualize we have several point data so here the point represents a location name that is Melbourne and here we have a location name called Sydney and similarly the line data here represented as a, a river in Australia and similarly the polygon the polygon can be represented as a country's boundary so entire the boundary of the Australia can be represented as a polygon so now let me zoom into the specific uh, location called Sydney So now you can able to visualize a variety of features that is available in this uh, location. So you can uh, visualize there is a lake, uh, it can be represented as a polygon and here we have our road networks so that ca it can be represented as a line and similarly the several location here it can be represented as a point data. So now let me zoom out. So now let us create our very first data set. So now go to the catalog section so that is available here so catalog so now let me show you the the location of catalog so go to the view section so so go to the view section and uh, click catalog pane so now it has been uh, shown in this in this here so now uh, click this option called folder so now uh, click this option called create a feature classes in ArcGIS so we have created a project called create a project called create a feature class in ArcGIS Pro. So that is represented here. So now let me click this. So here you can able to visualize we have four different uh, files here. One is backup and second one is uh, import log and third one is our geo database and fourth one is our tool. The toolbox in ArcGIS. So this is our location where we are going to save our feature classes 
that is our point line and polygon in this here uh, in this uh, file which is represented in the file format called gdb that is geo database so now uh, let us create a new folder called shape files so go to the option right click and go to the new section and click folder so now let me enter the name as shape files so now we have created a new shape files now I'll click this option right click so right click on the shape file folder so click this option called new and go to the shape files so now let us create a shape files so now let me zoom into the specific uh, city called Sydney So now I have zoomed into uh, the city called Sydney. So here you can able to visualize a lake in this part of the section, the reservoir. So it is a reservoir, a prospect reservoir. So we're going to create a boundary of this prospect reservoir. So for that we're going to use uh, our geometry type will be your polygon data. So we're going to create a polygon uh, feature around this, uh, the around the boundaries of this prospect reservoir. For that go to the option called uh, the parameters enter the feature class name so I have entered the feature class name as polygon so we're going to create a, a polygon uh, feature we're going to take the boundary of this reservoir so the geometry type will be so we have three different uh, geometry type that is point polygon and polyline so we're going to select the polygon so now we have to select our coordinate system so to select the coordinate system click this option so we have two different uh, system that is geographic coordinate system and projected coordinate system so here we're going to use a geographic coordinate system so for that go to the click this option called world and select WGS 1984 so I have selected WGS 1984 so now click OK so we have selected our coordinate system so now click this option called run so now you can able to visualize here we have our polygon has been created here which is indicated in our table of content so here the polygon shape file has been created so now let us start digitizing our uh, reservoir so let me zoom that so now go to the option called edit so now click this option called create a uh, create features so I click this option so now you can uh, able to visualize in this section we have our create feature section so uh, click this option so we have a different uh, so we have different create polygon features available here so for this video I will going to click this first option called create a polygon feature so I click this option now uh, now let us start digitizing our prospect reservoir in Australia so now let us uh, start digitizing now I will start digitizing this uh, reservoir so I'll click this point so now I have digitized this reservoir the prospect reservoir to finish the sketch double click this double click so the sketch has been finished so and this polygon has been highlighted in uh, blue color which is represented here so this is how you can create a feature class in ArcGIS Pro so in this video I have shown you the different feature classes in ArcGIS Pro and and how to create a polygon feature class in ArcGIS Pro so I have shown you a polygon feature here that is our reservoir prospect so thanks for watching and please subscribe to our channel and give us a like